this kind of brings us to, uh, you, you mentioned to me uh, that you'd gotten a survey from VHT Studios. I thought maybe you could open that survey. I, I understand you haven't filled it out yet and just take us through the questions and tell us how you would answer those survey questions. Sure, let me get it pulled up here. Uh, I got to find it, got to find it, got to find it. Okay, and a reminder, you can see all the digital assets that, that Tom is, uh, uh, was delivered from VHT Studios. Uh, just go to wgan.info forward slash Sparks Media Group. Tom is very prolific posting in the We Get Around Network forum. We gave him his own uh, short code to go find all his posts. If you look for the one that has a dollar sign, Two ninety nine in a headline. That's the topic we're talking about today. I I paid two hundred ninety nine dollars for a Matterport Digital Pro bundle for a real estate listing. What every Matterport service provider should know. So look for that topic, and then you'll see all the deliverables. Uh, in addition, I'll just point this out. Tom is is uh, I I know that I I posted all the photos, all twenty five photos, in the We Get Around Network forum, um, but. Our form, the We Get Around Net Network forum does do a little bit of compression. So I, I put a link to a Dropbox. So anyone that really wants to see the actual images that were delivered, not how they're displayed in the We Get Around Network forum, you can go to the original images. And also, you can see the same house shot by the same listing shot by Tom using a Matterport Pro 2 camera, a Matterport Pro 3 camera, a Matterport Axis smartphone rotator, a Ricoh Theta Z1 uh, 360 camera, a Insta360 um, RS 1 inch. Uh, this house has been is probably the most photographed house by with a Matterport solution <laughs> of, of any listing. And you can see the differences. So yeah. that, I think that's interesting in itself. Okay. So now. the video, the video I'm going to put out here shortly um, has links to all those. And it also has a link to, I used a Google drive. So it has a link to the Google drive of all the actual images. So people can look at them. Awesome. Um, okay. So you got your survey from VHT studios. What are the questions? What are your answers? So, you know, the, the survey, I was telling you kind of at the beginning of the call, it annoys me too, because it, it gives you a one to 10, but what is good and what is bad? I'm going to assume 10 is good and one is bad on this. Mm -hmm. um, so ordering experience, uh, I'm going to give it a nine, 10, maybe nine, mm -hmm. just because it's easy to order. I just wish it would have put that field in there that says, you know, what time do you want us to show there? Or what time do you want us to be there? Uh, scheduling, um, I'm going to give it a four. Uh, and that was time from ordering to the call from the photographer. I never got a call. I did get a text. Uh, photographer's availability. Which is like one of those details. I, you know, I just, this is just kind of like, like if you tell me you're going to text me, I'm expecting a text. If you tell me you're going to email me, I'm expecting an email. If you're going to tell me you're going to call me, I'm expecting a call. It sounds yeah. like they still don't have at a tactical level, operationally, all these things worked out surprisingly. Yeah, especially, I don't know, they're rolling, they have to be rolling out to a bunch of people. It's on their website and that's a pretty popular website. So <clears throat> um, photographer's availability to shoot at your desired date and time. I'm going to give that a zero or a one because they didn't give me a choice. Um, they worked efficiently, dressed appropriately. I'm going to give that a, you know, nine or 10. He was fine. Overall professionalism of the team. Uh, I'm going to give that a five just because that to me also speaks to photoshopping out power lines and delivering bad bathroom walls. Um, were they delivered in a timely manner? I'm going to give that a hmm, seven. Satisfaction with photog with final photography services. I'm going to give it like a four or three. Uh, overall, and you know, I'm very black and white. So usually it's the- uh, I thought these pictures pen. were in color. <laughs> usually it's it's very, you know, it's either going to be a zero or a 10. So I'm trying to be fair just because we come from a Yelp world and I would hate to get like a, a, a one star Yelp review. Um, uh, overall experience with VHT Studios, seven. Would I use their services again? Nope. Um, I'm not an agent. Well, to be fair, you're, you're a mystery spotter. 
uh, a mystery shopper. You went out and you shopped. Well, to be fair, fair, um, they were offering this two ninety nine package, and they didn't have any limitation on square footage from what they saw. What I saw, uh, so you know, if I have a ten thousand square foot listing come up, maybe I might have used them instead of sending one of my guys out and having to pay. You know, but I'm very loyal to my photographers. I would uh, still do that anyway. But you know, 